What expectations do you put on yourself personally in being a first round pick? I want to be good and I want to be great now, not later. So, you know, it can be hard, but that's what comes with the, with the being the first round pick. They're using you at the same position that they used Michael Bennett. First off, please tell me you're not going to be using those tiny shoulder pads that Michael Bennett used. No. You're not? Okay, good. No. -uh. <laughs> Just check. What do you think about that comparison in general? I mean, it's an honor. I've watched Michael Bennett for years. You know, he's a heck of a player, a really great player. You know, he's still in the league doing things today. You know, what he did with the Eagles, what he did here. You know, I remember that defense they had that won the Super Bowl. I, I didn't think those guys could be beat. And, you know, just being able to play here is an honor. You know, it's a high standard. I know what they go for and what they think of guys here. So I'm glad to be a part of that. You're from small town, Monday, Texas. Yes, sir. Describe your hometown. Well, it's small, it's a football town, you know. You can't, you know, you better not blink when you go through it, but <laughs> it's a great place for kids to grow up. You know, I loved it growing up. You know, you could do whatever you want. It's not getting any trouble, you know, play sports, play basketball. Fewer than 2,000 people in the city? I think it's like 1,300, yes. Are there street lights there? <sighs> Barely. When you come from a town of 1,300 people, how far away does the NFL seem? It seems very far because not very many. It doesn't happen a lot. And, you know, that's why I'm very hard on myself and to carry myself very well because I want this so bad because not a lot of people where I come from get this opportunity. You know, it's a once in a lifetime dream and I'm not going to ruin it. You say that you've lived with pressure your whole life. Yeah, for sure. You know, just from never being the, the most talented guy on my team, you know, even in college, you know, I've always had to work from the ground up. And, you know, it's an honor being the first round pick, but I know I'm still going to have to work here, you know, and I've had to, I've witnessed it in the day, my last few days being here. What's your first impression of being here in Seattle and in the NFL? I love it. You know, I've, I haven't had any second thoughts, you know, I'm ready to move in here fully, you know, give me a house, things like that. You know, the fans are great. I went to the Mariners game the other day and everybody was just, you know, it was just amazing. People were lined up to get my autograph, take pictures with me, and you know, I love that. I wait till they get good too. <laughs> um, <laughs> have you had your welcome to the NFL moment yet? Oh yeah, I have one today. You know, just my, just the speed of and stuff like that at practice and just, you know, just how they do things here. They're, they're efficient, you know, you just gotta know everything and I've had my work, to, I've had a few of them. Having made it here, what, what motivates you now? I wanna stay and, you know, I wanna be the best. I don't wanna just be, I don't wanna be complacent. I don't wanna just stay where I'm at now. I wanna be one of the best. I still do, you know, I wanna be looked at like the way they look at Jay Reed, Bobby, you know, KJ, those guys. You know, I wanna be the best in my position. I wanna play for as long as I can, you know. Because a lot of people still don't think that Seattle is right taking this pick with me and I'm there to prove them wrong because I know in my heart that I can do this. <laughs>